Hello everybody and welcome. Hope you're all safe and well. I am currently staying at the Double Dree by Hilton Hotel right next door to the Universal Orlando Resort and it's time to give you a little hotel review. Let's go. Just to give you an idea of how close we are to Universal. Behind me is the hotel. And then if I do a 360 here, you can see the walkway to go over the road. And in the background there, you've got the Universal Orlando Resort signage. So you have what is known as the North and the South Tower, both part of the hotel, and then a central sort of a lobby area. Walk through the front door to the beautiful lobby area. Reception is on your right. On the left you have a bar and grill. I've not ate there yet, but it looks nice. And there is a gift shop for some souvenirs and bits and bobs. Outside you have a beautiful courtyard and the waterfall where you can enjoy a Starbucks or something from pizza, burgers and more which is just over there. Towards the back of the hotel you have the swimming pool. I'm not going to get too close because there's quite a lot of people in there at the minute. hear the birds in the background but it's a lovely big swimming pool plenty of sun loungers getting lots of sun at the moment it's about midday and at the back you've got the pool bar next to the swimming pool you've got the game room just a selection of video games and air hockey for the small kids and the big kids and there's also a couple of microwaves just in case you want to heat up anything for your dinner next to the hotel there's tokens you just buy them and play there is also a guest laundry room if you need to get anything washed and cleaned someone's in there just now so i won't take you in but i'm sure you get the idea so this is our room um room 930 I've already been in just to drop off the bags. Um, as soon as you come in the room, on the right hand side, you have the bathroom. So it's your wash hand basin with soap and tissue paper. You've got a massive mirror on the wall. Some hand wash lotion there. Toilet. And you've got a full bathtub here. An overhead shower. And you've also got toiletries up in the wall so you've got shower gel shampoo and conditioner so ideal to have them all available for you this door is just for an adjoining room um, we don't have that of course just got the one room it's just myself and this room is a double queen bedroom with a universal orlando view You've got a full length mirror there. Hello. We have a really big cupboard closet here. A double door. Inside you've got some hangers, space for your bags at the bottom, a bag stand, safe. You've also got an iron and an iron board. So you've got your two queen size double beds here. And in the center you have the bedside table. Either side you've got charging points, uh, plugs, plus you've got one USB adapter either side, which is ideal for phones and tablets. This side you have a very large TV, I think that must be about a 50 inch TV. In the 
cupboard down here, there's a mini refrigerator, which is perfect for the warm Orlando climate. Get your kind of juice and water bottles in there, keep them cool. And then you've got four additional large storage drawers for clothes. Good deep drawer, so get plenty in there. You've got your coffee maker, with some tea and coffee on the side. And then you've got a, another mirror with a desk and chair if you need to get any work done. Over this side you've got your sort of lounge, comfy chair, uh, ice bucket and cups. And next to the floor to ceiling uh, window, that's the car park out there. Far away in the distance is Universal Orlando Resort. So on the right hand side there you've got Universal Studios, that's Rip Ride Rocket you can see going round. And on the left hand side you've got Islands of Adventure and that's the Hulk roller coaster going round in the middle. So a lovely big room, uh, just sitting in the beds here, they feel very comfy, I've yet to sleep in them but I'll let you know in the morning if I've had a good night's sleep. Plenty of space for four of you um, and very good value at this hotel. Hotel's lovely actually, a really really good standard, uh, especially for the value of money, so happy days, delighted with the room. Good morning everybody, that was a superb sleep here at the Double Tree by Universe. Hey guys, as much as what I always want to keep things positive, um, it's only fair to give you a level review and the flip side, so uh, the only two downsides that I came across here at the hotel um, apart from the noise through the room, but that wasn't necessarily the hotel's fault. Uh, one, parking was $27 a night. I didn't have a car, but if you do have a car, that's going to get you over a good few nights. And two, outside the hotel, there aren't a great amount of restaurants and shops. There's a select few. There's Miller's Ale, Ale House, there's McDonald's, there's Wendy's, there's Friday's restaurant. There's a walking as well, so there's a few bits to keep you going. Uh, but if you're staying here for two weeks, you probably want a better selection. You'd maybe take yourself into International Drive, which is only a few minutes away by Uber, or you can jump on the iRain trolley or drive. Uh, but yeah, that's just a kind of couple of small negatives I thought I'd add in just to give a kind of fair representation of stay, but all in all, still a good hotel. So just checking out the Double Tree Hotel here. Um, couple of nights stay was perfect, no complaints at all. Staff have been brilliant, the room was really comfortable and clean and perfectly located for Universal Orlando Resort. So, super couple of nights here. I would highly recommend, uh, for me it would be four stars. Why not? Four stars. So, thanks for watching, uh, like and subscribe please, it would be great, really help us out, and see you next time. Cheers guys, bye.